Shalom and happy new month of December to you and your families and friends. So we do have new subscribers. This channel started with only six subscribers. And the last time I checked, we are 425 subscribers already within an year. We are 425 subscribers. And that's a huge blessing for us here with Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, with the Holy Spirit. We are so glad for the 425 subscribers. And if you welcome, this is the channel of Jesus and Mary and the bible and the rosary has to go hand in hand because they are all same and one the rosary prayed already on this channel the last time i checked we have prayed 41000 rosaries on this channel <laughs> we have prayed 41000 rosaries on this channel and i am so glad in jesus and mary for this so today is on 1st of december and it's already it's friday and all our Friday rosary prayers, we pray to the souls in purgatory and all the departed souls. And also being the first Friday of the month, it's also the devotion to the sacred heart of Jesus Christ. So we are going to, to pray to the sacred heart of Jesus to have mercy on all the souls in purgatory and all the departed souls. So thank you for coming and let us pray in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Heavenly Father, we come to you this wonderful first day of the month, being on a Friday, the first Friday of the month, we pray, we pray to the sacred heart of your Son, Jesus Christ, for all the souls in purgatory and for all the departed souls of people we know and people we don't know of. For this reason, Abba Father, we need your presence. Please come with Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, and with your Holy Spirit. Please come and join us as we offer this today's rosary to the sacred heart of your Son, Jesus Christ, that he may have mercy for all the souls in purgatory and all the departed souls. Amen. Internal rest grant unto them, O Lord, and let your perpetual light shine upon them. May their souls rest in peace. Amen. Internal rest grant unto them, O Lord, and let your perpetual light shine upon them. May their souls rest in peace. Amen. Internal rest grant unto them, O Lord, and let your perpetual light shine upon them. May their souls rest in peace. Amen. I confess to Almighty God and you, my brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned in my thoughts, in my words, in what I've done and what I've failed to do, through my faults, through my faults, through my most grievous faults. Therefore, I ask Blessed Mary, ever virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. I believe in one God, the Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth. I believe in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord. He was conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary. He suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended to hell. On the third day, He rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven, and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From there, He shall come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on other cities done in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And it does not temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, today in a special way we bring to you into your hands the rosary of the sorrowful mystery, the divine mercy as we pray for the souls in purgatory and for all the departed souls. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the hour of our death. Amen. The first sorrowful mystery, the agony of Jesus in the garden. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it was done in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And he does not temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Glory be to God the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, never shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls into heaven, and especially those in most need of thy mercies. Saint Joseph the Walker, together with all the holy angels and saints, and the archangels in heaven, pray for the souls in purgatory, and for all the departed souls. Amen. The second sorrowful mystery, Jesus is caused at the pillar. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is done in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our dead. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Glory be to God, the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, never shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls into heaven, and especially those in most need of thy mercies. Saint Joseph the Walker, together with all the holy angels and saints and the archangels in heaven, pray for the souls in purgatory and for all the departed souls. Amen. The third sorrowful mystery, Jesus is crowned with thorns. Our Father that in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is done in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not temptation but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hey, oh. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen.
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Glory be to God the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, never shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls into heaven, and especially those in most need of thy mercies. Saint Joseph the Waka, together with all the holy angels and saints, and the archangels in heaven, Pray for the souls in purgatory and for all the departed souls. Amen. The fourth sorrowful mystery, Jesus carries the cross. Father that in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is done in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And it does not temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for our sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for our sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary. Full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now to the of our death. Amen. Glory be to God the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, never shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls into heaven, and especially those in most need of thy mercies. Saint Joseph the Waka, together with all the holy angels and saints, and the archangels in heaven, pray for the souls in purgatory, and and for all the departed souls. Amen. The fifth sorrowful mystery, the crucifixion and death of our Lord Jesus Christ. 
Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on other cities done in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now till they are far dead. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now till they are far dead. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now till they are far dead. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now till they are far dead. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now till they are far dead. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now till they are far dead. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now till they are far dead. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now till they are far dead. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now till they are far dead. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now till they are far dead. Amen. Glory be to God, the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls into heaven, and especially those in most need of thy mercies. Saint Joseph the Waka, together with all the holy angels and saints, and the archangels in heaven, pray for all the souls in Bagdad and all the departed souls to the Father that they may receive his mercies to eternal life in heaven. Amen. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, hail our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry for our bunny children of Eve. To thee do we send up our signs, mourning and weeping this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious advocate, then eyes of mercy towards us. And after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Pray for all the souls in purgatory and all the departed souls, O Holy Mother of God, that they may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. May we go back to that first bid of the first mystery of the Holy Rosary, that we may offer the souls in purgatory and all the departed souls to the divine mercy of our Lord Jesus Christ. Lord, eternal Father, we offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. 
for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. Internal Father, we offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. Internal Father, we offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. Internal Father, we offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. Internal Father, we offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, 
Have mercy on us and the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Mortal One, have mercy on us and the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Mortal One, have mercy on us and the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Mortal One, have mercy on us and the whole world. O blood and water, which he gushed forth from the heart of Jesus, as a fount of mercy for all the souls in purgatory and for all the departed souls we trust in you O blood and water which he gushed forth from the heart of jesus as a fount of mercy for all the souls in purgatory and for all the departed souls we trust in you O blood and water which he gushed forth from the heart of jesus as a fount of mercy for all the souls in purgatory and for all the departed souls we trust in you jesus we trust in you jesus we trust in you jesus we trust in you eternal god in whom mercy is endless and the treasury of compassion inexhaustible look kindly upon us and increase your mercy in us that in difficult moments we might not despair nor become despondent but with the great confidence submit ourselves to your most holy will which is love and mercy itself amen memory into our blessed virgin mother mary for the souls in purgatory and for all all the departed souls remember O most gracious virgin mary that never was it known that anyone who fret your protection implored your help or sought intercession was left unaided inspired by this confidence we fly unto you O virgin of virgins our mother to you do we come before you we stand sinful and sorrowful O mother of the word incarnate despise not our petitions but in your mercy hear and answer us amen we also pray with the memory of saint joseph the worker as the saint of this channel and protector of our faith Remember, most pure spouse of Mary, ever virgin, my loving protector, Saint Joseph, that no one ever had recourse to your protection or asked for your aid without obtaining relief. Confiding, therefore, in your goodness, I come before you and humbly implore you, despise not my petitions, foster father of the Redeemer, but graciously receive them. Amen. Saint Michael the Archangel, defend us in the day of battle. Be our safeguard against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And do thou, O Prince of Heavenly Host, by the divine power of God, cast into hell Satan and all other evil spirits who wander throughout the world, seeking the ruins of souls. Amen. Angel of God, my guardian dear, to whom God's love commits me here, ever this they be at my side to light and guide to rule and guard amen and in the mighty name of our lord jesus christ we do surrender to his sacred heart all the souls in purgatory and all the departed souls that he may have mercy on them and bring them to eternal life in heaven amen so for those of us who are going on with the Bible studies, we are in the mission to read the whole Bible. We are going to read today we are in the book. And today we are in the book of First Samuel chapter 17. I hope by now those who already know we are reading the whole Bible 
on this channel you have already bought your own catholic bibles that's the one i'm using <laughs> we have so many bibles out there and they are all amazing the reason why i'm using the bible for the catholic bible is because you are going to cover even the books which are not in other bibles so we still need your presence our father we need you with jesus mary and joseph and with the holy spirit give us your spirit of knowledge, understanding, and above all, wisdom. So those of us who are with us on yesterday's book, already Samuel has already anointed David as the new king for the Israelites, although he's a young man. And already even though Saul is still the king, he's been having all these evil spirits tormenting him. And the only thing that the solution that was given was some music to be prayed for him. And that's how he got David. So myself, I never knew how how Saul and David came together. I used to know that every time Saul would have evil spirit attacking him, David would be always be there to play some music for him. I never knew how they all came about, but yesterday we got the knowledge and understanding of that. So let's see what happened. The book of First Samuel chapter 17. The Philistines rallied their forces for battle at Sokol in Judah and encamped between Sokol and Ezekiah at Ephsadaim. Saul and the Israelites also gathered and camped in the valley of the Terebinth, drawing up their battle line to meet the Philistines. The Philistines were stationed on the hill and the Israelites on, on an opposite hill with a valley between them. A champion, <laughs> a champion named Goliath of Gath came out from the Philistine camp. He was six and a half feet tall. <laughs> this guy was a very tall guy. At least I know about Goliath. They have uh, some uh, knowledge about him. He was a very tall guy. So at least we confirm he was six and a half feet tall. He had a bronze helmet on his head and wore a bronze corset of skill armor weighing 5,000 shekels and bronze greaves and had a bronze kimita. So they are describing Goriath, how he looked like on his height, on what he was wearing. Yeah, slag from Baldric, the shaft of his javelin was like a weaver shadow bar and its iron head weighed 600 shekels. His shield bearer went before him. He stood and shouted to the ranks of Israel, Why come out in battle formation? I am a Philistine and you are soul servants. Choose one of your men and have him come down to me. If he beats me in combat and kills me, we will be your vessels. But if I beat him and kill him, you shall be our vessels and serve us. The Philistine continued, I defy the lungs of Israel today. Give me a man and let us fight together. So, and all the men of Israel, when they heard this challenge of the Philistine, were dismayed and terror-stricken. David was the son of an Ephrite named Jesse, you remember that yesterday, who was from Bethlehem in Judah. He had eight sons, and in the days of Saul was old, and in the days of Saul, was old and were on in years. The three oldest sons of Jesse had followed Saul to war. These three sons who had gone off to war were named the firstborn Eliab, the second son Abinadab, and the third Shama. David was the youngest while the three oldest had joined Saul. David would go and come from Saul to attend his fathership at Bethlehem.
Remember, Jesus was born in the lineage of David and he was born in Bethlehem. We, we, we mentioned that yesterday's uh, rosary prayers, those who joined us on rosaries for yesterday. <clears throat> Sorry about that. I keep on clearing my throat. So meanwhile, the Philistine came forward and took his stand morning and evening for 40 days. Can you imagine? <laughs> so meanwhile, the Philistine came forward and took his stand morning and evening for 40 days. So for 40 days, they were still looking who is going to fight this Goliath guy. And they have not seen anyone because they were all scared. This guy is a giant. Now, Jesse said to his son, David, take this epad of roasted grain and these 10 loaves of your brothers. Uh, take this. Now, Jesse said to his son, David, no, he's the youngest and he's at home taking care of the sheep for his father in Bethlehem. Take this epad of roasted grain. And these ten loaves of your brothers and bring them quickly to your brothers in the camp. <clears throat> also, take these ten cheeses. Wow, cheese. <laughs> also take these ten cheeses for the field officers. Greet your brothers and bring home some token from them. Saul and they and all Israel are fighting against the Philistine in the valley of Terebin. So they thought that there was a fight going on and no fight took place because they just needed one man to go and beat up Goriath. Early the next morning, having left the flock with a shepherd, David set out on his errands as Jesse had commanded him. He reached the barricade of the camp just as the army on the way to the battleground were shouting their battle cry. The Israelites and the Philistines drew up opposite each other in the battle array. David entrusted what he had bought to the what he had brought to the keeper of the baggage and hastened to the battle line, where he greeted his brothers. While he was talking with them, the Philistine champion, by name Goliath of God, came up from the ranks of the Philistine and spoke as before, and David listened. You know what he said, okay? So they should bring one man to beat him up. If they beat up Goliath, they become the, the Philistine will become servants of Israelites. And if Philistines win, the Israelites become their servants. So David listened. When the Israelites saw the man, they all retreated from him. Remember, he's a giant, very much afraid. This is us. <laughs> this is us. When you're facing all those huge problems in life, we get scared and we become afraid. Even when we trust in God, we just feel there's some kind of fear that we have. And then we remember we have a God. He's bigger than our problems. But at the same time, we remain afraid until when we see the hand of God doing something in our lives. That when you're like, oh, thank you, God, you did it for us. That is how we do it. Even our day to day lives, we get scared of our huge problems, which we always have faith that they cannot be huge than our God. Yeah. So we go on. <laughs> When the Israelites saw the man, they all retreated before him, very much afraid. The Israelite had been saying, Do you see this man coming up? He comes up to insult Israel. If anyone should kill him, the king would give him great wealth, daughter as well, and would grant exception to his father's family in Israel. David now said to the man standing by, what will, we, what we will be done for the man who kills this Philistine and frees Israel of their disgrace? This is David asking. Now, David, David now said to the men standing by, remember these are his brothers, okay? What will be done for the man who kills this Philistine and frees Israel of the disgrace? Who is this uncircumcised Philistine? In any case that he should insult the armies of the living God, 
they repeated the exact thing I was saying. <laughs> the questions of David, as of what I've mentioned, like we have these huge problems, but we have faith in God. But at the same time, you are scared, okay? That's what I'm asking. They're the same questions that David is also asking. They repeated the same words to him and said, This is how the man who kills him will be rewarded. When Ariab, his oldest brother, heard him speaking with the men, he grew angry with David and said, Why did you come down? With whom have you left those sheep in the desert meanwhile? I know your arrogance and your evil intent. You came down to enjoy the battle. David replied, What have I done now? I was only talking. Yet he turned from him to another and asked the same question, and everyone gave him the same answer as before. The words that David had spoken were overheard and reported to Saul, who sent for him. Now remember, Saul knows David because he plays music for him. Then David spoke to Saul, Let your majesty not lose courage. I am at your service to go and fight this Philistine. But so answered David, you, can go, you cannot go up against this Philistine and fight with him, for you are only a youth, while he has been a warrior for this youth. Oh, but so answered David, you cannot go up against this Philistine and fight with him, for you are only a youth where he has been a warrior from his youth. Then David told Saul, Your servant used to tend his father's sheep, and whenever a lion or bear came to carry off a sheep from the flock, I would go after it and attack it and rescue the prey from its mouth. If it attacked me, I would seize it by the jaw, strike it, and kill it. So David killed even a lion. Your servant has killed both a lion and a bear. And in this uncircumcised Philistine will be as one of them because he has insulted the armies of the living God. Now this is David arguing his chance to go and fight the Philistine. <laughs> me, I have always wanted this kind of courage. I don't know if it's me myself. Every time I'm facing kind of challenges in life, I always have this trust on Jesus that he can do it for me, but at the same time I'm scared. And then suddenly I'm like, ah, God will provide for me. And then suddenly I'm like, God is with me in Jesus and Mary. Like there are those courage words I give myself. And this is the same thing that David is even doing to, to Saul. Like to give ourselves courage in the middle of it all, the most important courage that I give myself is the Lord God is with me in Jesus and Mary. I always would say those words every time I feel I'm in the middle of of worrying about some problem that I could be going through in my life. And by the end of the day, the Lord God in Jesus and Mary always shows up to help me. So we go on. David continued, The Lord who delivered me from the cross of the lion and the bear will also keep me safe from the crutches of this Philistine. So answered David, Go, the Lord be with you. Then the soul then Saul clothed David in his own tunic, putting a bronze helmet on his head and arming him with a coat of mail. David also guarded himself with soul sword over the tunic. He walked with difficulty. However, since he had never tried Amar before, he said to Saul, I cannot go in this because I have never tried them before. So he took them off. Then staff in hand, David selected five smooth stones from the wadi and put them in the pocket of his shepherd's bag. With his sling, also ready to hand, he approached the Philistine. With his shield bearer marching before him, the Philistine also advanced closer and closer to David. Philistine is Godiath, okay? 
Goliath is the Philistine. When he had seized David up and seen that he was a youthful and ruddy and handsome in appearance, he held him in contempt. The Philistine said to David, I am I a dog? <laughs> the Philistine, now this is Goliath, said to David, Am I a dog that you come against me with a staff? Then the Philistine cast David and his gods and said to him, Come here to me, and I will leave your flesh for the birds of the air and the beasts of the field and the beasts of the field. David answered him, You come against me with a sword and spear and scimitar, but I come against you. In the name of the Lord host, the God of the armies of Israel, that you have insulted. Today, the Lord shall deliver you into my hands. I will strike you down and cut off your head. This very day, I will leave your corpse and the corpse of the Philistine army for the birds of the air and the beasts of the field. Thus the whole land shall learn that Israel has a God. We need this kind of courage. <laughs> we need this kind of courage when you're facing all these life challenges and problems and desperate cases. We need to remember this. We need to remember this, what David said. We need this kind of courage that David had when he, got, when he went to, to face the Philistine Goliath. All this multitude too shall learn that it is not by sword or spear that the Lord saves. For the battle is the Lord's, and he shall deliver you into our hands. The Philistine then moved to meet David. Every time I say the Philistine, just know that is Goriath at cross quarters. While David ran quickly towards the battle line in the direction of the Philistine, David put his hand into the bag and took out a stone, hurled it with the string, like he put the stone in the bag, hurled it with the string, and struck the Philistine on the forehead. The stone embedded itself in his bro and he fell prostrate on the ground. Thus David overcame the Philistine with a sling and stone. He struck the Philistine mortality and did it and did it without a sword. Then David ran and stood over him with the Philistine's own sword. The Philistine is Goliath. Now, now they are not mentioning Goliath. They are using the name Philistine. <laughs> Because Goliath uh, represented the whole of Philistine. Thus David overcame the Philistine with the sling and stone. He struck the Philistine mortality and did it without a sword. Then David ran and stood over him with the Philistine's own sword, which he drew from its sheath. He dispatched him and cut off his head. When they saw that their hero was dead, the Philistine took to fright. That means they ran away. They ran away. And remember these people, they have always they stayed in that camp for 40 days and 40 nights. That's when who shows up? David shows up. And because he was sent to go and bring food to his brothers. Then the men of Israel and Judah, with loud shouts, went in pursuit of the Philistine to the approaches of Gad and to the gates of Ekron. And Philistine fell wounded along the road from Sharaim as far as Gad and Ekron. On their return from the pursuit of the Philistine, the Israelites looted their camp. David took the head of the Philistine and brought it to Jerusalem. But he kept Goriath Amar in his own tent. What? On their return from the pursuit of Philistine, the Israelites looted their camp. David took the head of the Philistine and brought it to Jerusalem, but he kept Goliath's armor in his own tent. 
So David kept the armor of Goriath in his own tent, and the head he took to Jerusalem. When Saul saw David go out to meet the Philistine, he saw he asked his general Abanel, Abanel, whose son is that youth? Abanel replied, As truly as your majesty live, I have no idea. And the king said, Find out whose son the lad is. So when David returned from slaying the Philistine, Abaddon took him and presented him to Saul. David was still holding the Philistine's head. Saul then asked him, Whose son are you, young man? David replied, I am the son of your servant Jesse of Bethlehem. The word of the Lord, thanks be to God. Heavenly Father, we come to surrender all our battles to you. We have our battles, we have our problems and our challenges, all those desperate cases that we have. May we take all of them. Abba Father, take them all and make them your own. And please deliver us the same way you helped David to deliver the children of Israel from the Philistine Goliath. Give us your victory this day and bless us through your divine Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. And anoint us with your Holy Spirit, with our guardian angels. In the name of the Father the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you all for coming. So, <laughs> I'm sorry, today's rosary prayers were a bit long. From tomorrow, we are praying with the litany of the infant Jesus because it's a one way of preparing us for the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ. Until then, be blessed for coming and let's meet tomorrow for rosary prayers and Bible studies. Be blessed for coming.